So yes, I did see it. I think most of us did. Marvel Studios has a new logo. They changed the color of the traditional Marvel Studios red logo to a brand new blue one. We'll talk about why I don't think this is important as many people are seeming to think it is. Okay, so before we get to it, let's play that clip in slow-mo and you guys will be able to see what I'm talking about. You picked up on it. Here's the red logo and it shifts to blue. Now, many people think that this is an indicator that Marvel Studios is officially changing their logo's color to blue. That Marvel Studios is not going to use red anymore and that blue is the new direction. Now, I can like 100% say this is not happening. So first, let me take care of the dumbest theory I've seen out there that people have subscribed to, and that's the idea that they're shifting to a blue logo to fool people that they're like DC Comics or something, that they're backpedaling off DC. Last I checked, Marvel Studios is the number one studio in the world and the most successful film company of all time, so no. Okay, now that that stupid thing is out of the way, the whole reason they did this is to differentiate the two divisions. We know Marvel Studios is going to be dealing with Marvel Films. We know Marvel TV Studios is going to be dealing with the TV side of things. They're all under Kevin Feige, but there is going to be a difference between the two. If you separate the logo colors, people will subliminally know blue will mean TV, red will mean the films. That's the whole reason they're doing this. It's a small transition. It's a different type of transitional logo. That's all it is. Marvel has literally been, you know, synonymous with the color red since its inception. That's not going to change. They're not going to rebrand everything to a blue color. That just wouldn't make any sense for any reason. And honestly, you know, I can see why people might think that, but that's just not the way they're going to handle it. And more than likely, as most people will recall in the past, when a new phase has started, they've been looking to change up the logos. So there is a very good possibility that with Black Widow, but more than likely Eternals, we're going to get a brand new Marvel Studios logo. And then the TV division will also have one as well. Right now, this discoloration is just a placeholder.